But anyway, uh, Andrew Tate, right? Andrew Tate is dumb, all right? Greta Thunberg is dumb. I don't have a problem with Andrew Tate. And, you know, I'm not going to sit here and talk about his message like that and things like that. It really doesn't matter to me what he has to say. I don't pay attention to the guy. But I do know a little bit about him. I do know a little bit about his message and things like that. And his message, if you want to sum it up, is basically just telling men, hey, have self-esteem. Right? Don't be a... Don't be a don't be a big have self-esteem okay uh now there are specific things that he has to say that kind of give me pause a little bit right i'm not gonna sit here and say that that is the entirety of his message all the time and that he hasn't had some weird things go down obviously he has right uh but that is his message and to have him, somebody who is generally not throwing hate and vitriol towards men, be arrested in the way that he was, is very strange to me. Now, I obviously don't support if there was any kind of a uh, if there was any kind of that, right? I don't want to say it too much because I don't know what YouTube is cool and not cool with. But if there is any of that by any chance, uh, he deserves to be punished for it, right? Severely. However, I find the timing to be weird, and that's what I want to talk about. Now, he's sitting here. He has a message that is generally positive for men. He doesn't want to see men suffer. He doesn't want to see men be treated like garbage and things like that. And because of this, there's a lot of people out there who have a political bent, who have a political issue, right, who are on the opposite side of that, who want to throw vitriol towards men who want to see men suffering and alone and in just living in darkness, right? Those people, well, sometimes they end up having, they have a lot of power. Now, he ends up doing his thing. People generally just make fun of him. They generally just hate on him and things like that, but they leave him alone for the most part. Then he starts going after Greta, Greta Thunberg, the, the Thunberg. All right. Uh, he starts going after Thunberg, who is the media darling. OK, everybody in the media, everybody in the controlled media is loving the shit out of her. She is she's the she's the girl. Right. Even if it was a couple of years ago when she was especially relevant, she's still the girl. Well, I just find it interesting that after he ended up going after her, he ends up getting arrested for human trafficking. Now, I know what people are thinking. Oh, well, I mean, it was because they 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 figured out where he was after he ended up ordering a pizza to his place and the pizza box doxed him. It's like, really? You think that's what it is? You think that's what it is in the uh, modern era? People are sitting there. They're getting doxxed by pizza boxes. The Romanian government had no fucking clue where or who this guy was. Oh, well, they knew who he was, but they didn't know where this guy was. They had no idea. They had to wait for him to, to order a fucking pizza so that they could use the pizza box to dox him to where he's at. No, they fucking knew where he was the entire time. I do not. If, if you if you tried to convince me they didn't know where he was, uh, I would tell you you are a fucking idiot. They knew where he was this entire fucking time, and they only arrested him conveniently after a spat with Greta Thunberg, somebody who is, I would imagine, a very powerful person, very, uh, oh, bullshit, very powerful person, all right, if not her personally, she's got very powerful people around her. You don't get to be the level of notorious that she has without having some kind of legitimate institutional power around you right to a point right it's so bad right that there's no way that this girl uh said what she said right even just dissecting uh what she ended up saying to him right do you think that do you think that greta thunberg uh was the one who ended up saying what she said do you think that's what and do you think that's how it was do you think do you do you really think she, I, I'm, I'm trying to remember exactly what was said back to Andrew Tate, but it was something that you know was way beyond her level of banter, right? As somebody who is uh, uh, known for being a little bit, uh, 
you, you, you know, you know the way Greta Thunberg is, right? Again, I, I want to be very careful. I don't know what YouTube is going to allow and what they're not going to allow. Uh, you know that it was somebody who was like, hey, 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 Greta. Hey, hey, Greta. Hey, bud. Hey, hey, buddy. Hey, you know, that that Andrew Tate sure is a big old meanie face. He's he's a he's a big old meanie, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Climate, climate, climate. Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Whatever you say. We'll, we'll talk about the climate later. But, but uh, you, you know what you should say to Andrew, right? You, you should, you should, you should say he's got small dick energy. And you know, Greta was sitting there like small dick energy, but I have not seen his dick. I do, I do not want to see his dick. Where, uh, how would I know that he's got this, this small dick energy? If I have never seen his dick, if I have never seen his penis, and uh, the handler is sitting there like, no, 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 no. You see, you don't understand. Uh, it, you, you don't have to see his dick. You don't have to see his dick. It, it's, it's not about that. It's about trying to burn him. But burn him. But, but if, if I was to, to burn him, that would be bad for the, the climate, and that, that would also be murder, and I, I could not. I could not do that. That that would be weighing on my conscience. And they're just sitting there trying to explain it to her. Getting to a point where they're just like, yo, yo, just give me the fucking phone, Greta. All right, give me the fucking phone. Just trust me. All right. Just give me the phone and we'll do our thing. Um, uh, uh, I got to be careful around here. Well, you see, and that's what I got to be careful of. Greta Thunberg did not end up saying what ended up on her... Twitter. That was a handler, right? Uh, in my opinion, right? This is not a statement of fact or anything like that. And I'm the reason why I'm highlighting that is to illustrate the point that this person is basically just a figurehead. Son of a bitch, dude. This person's a figurehead. That's what they are. That's what they've always been. The idea that Andrew Tate only gets arrested after going after Greta Thunberg, I don't think that's a coincidence. And it's not the first time we've seen that kind of shit. Uh, Bill Cosby, right? Now, did Bill Cosby do what he did? I don't know. If he did, that's not cool, and I believe that demands some kind of punishment. All right? Uh, however, I don't think it's a coincidence that right after he goes on speaking tours telling people to pull up their pants and to not be gangsters and things like that all of a sudden he ends up getting fucked all of a sudden he ends up uh having mad women coming out the woodwork to say what they were saying right you got to look at the timeline of events here you got to look at that and you got to think huh what could somebody gain what does somebody have to gain from him being off the street what does somebody have to gain from uh bill cosby not being allowed to speak what does somebody have to gain by not having Andrew Tate around? What does somebody have to gain by not having Bill Cosby around? What does somebody have to gain by not having this person or that person or the other person around? That's what you have to ask. And when you start noticing how everything kind of comes together, you may not be able to fuck. You may not be able to say for certain. Yeah, yeah, it's it's definitely this. It's definitely it's definitely uh, for sure a conspiracy, but it makes certain things a little bit weird, not gonna lie. But yeah, it's interesting to me, right? It's interesting, it's a little bit funny. And, uh, you know, it's, it's a hoot and holler in good time. Uh, I'll, ta I'll take bets on whether or not Andrew Tate has charges dropped. I'll take bets on whether or not Andrew Tate ends up back on the street again, right? I, I would assume he probably would, you know? He's got enough money for good lawyers and shit like that. Um, in addition to that, like I said, I don't know if the Chargers are legit. It could be a fucking pu publicity stunt. You know, you never know. It, he could he could have paid somebody to doctor up just the right fucking thing and stuff like that, right? Um, I'm not saying that it totally is. Like, I believe that chances are... There we go. I believe chances are it is real. But, like, anything's possible, man. I'm a... I've, there we go. As I was saying, anything's possible, and I definitely believe that uh, that um, it could be fake, but I do really believe that it is probably real. 
Make certain things a... Uh, oh, it's clearing. Alright. Make certain things a little bit harder to really... Why? Alright. There we go. Yeah, like, I was right there, and for some reason, I wasn't able to get him. Uh, I'm just, I'm just as clueless as that dude. 